Let us all that we can to build a better future. Hey, Lauren. Hey, Kit. So, you know, when you say the quiet part loud, you know, you, you, you hopefully you, no one heard it and that eventually it dies down and no one will ever bring it up again. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, yeah. well, it turns out. And hey, hey, folks, don't get angry with me. Everyone just calm down for a minute. Just calm down. Sit down. Don't get angry. Uh, but I do want to give a shout out to Ryan Grimm for at least capturing these 18 seconds, 19 seconds to be precise, of probably one of the most funniest moments on uh, cable TV. So as we all know, uh, there is still this ongoing, uh, again, deconstruction of what's happening with the FTX scandal. And I want to pull this interview up that I did with Whitney Webb. So it is only available on our uh, Rock Hunter Lens Media Rockfin account. And I say this because we're, uh, again, the YouTube censorship is all too real. Uh, I was interviewing Whitney Webb on the FTX scandal, political corruption, big tech censorship, and more. Um, and obviously, we were talking about individuals, people's names who uh, would get us flagged on YouTube. It's mm-hmm. a four minute long interview. So uh, this was a phenomenal interview that I did with uh, Whitney Webb in regards to what's happening with FTX. Uh, it will also be on our uh, local channel, Can TV. I just recently shared it with that network there. So that will be available for anyone that has public access television in the Chicago land area. So why am I bringing this up? Well, because on Fox News of all places, Fox News, and again, shout out to Ryan Grimm for capturing this. Um, Terry Duffy slips up, slips up and admits to bribing a regulator. Oh no. So I know, I know I'm saying something nice about Ryan Grimm. I occasionally, sometimes, sometimes people you don't like can say something or do something good. Occasionally, occasionally, occasionally. As someone involved in business would, why did none of the regulators do that? Where was Gary Gensler? Well, I don't know where Gary Gensler was, but my regulator at the CFTC, I bribed. I asked them, why in the world are you invoking the Commodity Exchange Act, Section 5, Paragraph B, as someone involved in business would? Why did none of the regulators do that? Where was Gary Gensler? Well, I don't know where Gary Gensler was, but my regulator at the CFTC, I bribed. I I bribed. So just so you all know, I get 19 seconds of beauty. Hold on. TC, I bribed. Hold on. One more time. I'm sorry. See, I bribed. (laughs) Lauren, your thoughts real quick. <laughs> I mean, you can see that, like, the immediate regret on his face and how he tried to, like, backtrack <laughs> and start talking about, like, policy numbers and par- subparagraph B. It's like, oh, my gosh. But you can see in his face, like, he's like, oh, no. Like, wow. Oh, no. He made what we all call an oopsie. So, Obviously, um, if you really want a better insight in this, uh, Whitney Webb, again, phenomenal researcher. She did. She she also did her own podcast and she speaks about it on the interview that I did with her on Rockfin uh, about FTX and the overall um, absolute unchecked corruption that we are seeing here in this country. If you want to see the full interview, please, I'm just going to bring it up uh, just one more time. Um, just for all of you to enjoy yourself. Because again, I I want to talk about what we did talk about, but you have to see it for yourself on Rockfin because I don't want to get censored or hit with anything because I'm because we talk about names and whistleblowers and other people uh, in that interview. But here we go again. Shout out to Whitney Webb interview on the FTX scandal. She goes into absolute detail about just really what happened with that organization and how he's pretty much getting away with it. Um, you know, the last time we saw something like this on this level of this kind of Ponzi scheme, uh, we compared it to Bernie Madoff. There's a name that you can say on YouTube. Uh, but the only difference is that the only reason why Bernie Madoff went behind jail, went went behind bars so fast is that he robbed from the rich, (laughs) which is, and he didn't even have the balls to give it to the poor. I mean, (laughs) you're doing the Robin Hood thing wrong, Bernie. (laughs) 
so I guess one more time, just 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 for people to get a good good kick out of it. All right, because I I can't honestly, Ryan Grimm. I'll have to agree as Ryan Grimm. This is absolutely the most glorious moment in cable television. <laughs> as this is funniest I've ever seen it too. As someone involved in business would. Why did none of the regulators do that? Where was Gary Gensler? Well, I don't know where Gary Gensler was, but my regulator at the CFTC, I bribed. I regulator at the CFTC, I bribed. Regulator at the CFTC, I bribed. I asked them, <laughs> why in the world are you involved? I bribed. I asked them. I asked, I, I, asking I, I, and bribing are not the same. I, I, what did I do? What did I do? Tucker, Tucker, Tucker's making that face. It, it, it's easy. Tucker never makes another face other than that. That is just his I, face forever and always. I know, I know. But honestly, if I was in Tucker's uh, spot, I'd be, <laughs> uh, sir, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Wait, I want, I want to do this right because this, this is absolutely funny. We're starting off on a funny note, folks. Hold on, Lauren. I'm going to slightly remove you. Hang on. I'll be right back. Um, sir, did you just say the word bribe? <laughs> No, I said asked. I said asked for sure. I said asked. Asked, asked my regulator guy. I asked him about this very specific paragraph. It was asked is the word I use, but I don't how'd you hear bribe? They don't even sound alike. It's fine. It was asked. it's hilarious, folks. Hey, we're starting off on a funny note. Isn't that great? Now, aren't you glad you're tuning into Hard Lens Media? So I think as a final note, uh, if you want to just check out the full inter- uh, the real stuff that's happening with FTX, check out Whitney Webb's podcast and also check out the interview that I did with her as well. Uh, it was this week. It was phenomenal. And uh, again, it's, it's only available on the Hard Lens Media Rockfin page.